Hello and welcome to the 7th International Mountain Bike Rally of Sardinia. After a five-year hiatus, the Rally of Sardinia is back. Supported and sponsored by the Tourism Department of the Autonomous Region of Sardinia and the Municipality of Arzana. The town of Arzana will be the centre of the action for the three days of the International Mountain Bike Rally. Giova tantissimo non solo ad Arzana ma giova tantissimo alla Sardegna e all'Ogliastra. È un veicolo, come detto prima, di grande promozione territoriale che utilizza lo sport per promuovere ciò che di bello abbiamo. Per noi è fondamentale, tant'è vero che il Comune investe una cifra molto rilevante per poterla realizzare. The route of the 2018 edition of the International Mountain Bike Rally of Sardinia has already been defined. It's a wonderful location promising great racing. A qua uh, qua Arzana non sono mai stato. Non abbiamo mai corso qua Arzana, dunque è, questa è la prima volta che, che vengo qua, eh, era il mio sogno venire qua per fare i rally, posti bellissimi, stupendi, eh, sperando se ripropongono a giugno di nuovo i rally di Sardegna non mancherò ad essere iscritto per, per ripartire qua e ne vale la pena, ne vale la pena esserci. The rally has three stages, with a total distance of 265 kilometers and 7,400 meters of ascent. It's a very challenging route that will put all the participants to the test. As always, the International Mountain Bike Rally of Sardinia will cross breathtaking views and many untouched places that only the wild Sardinia can offer. Another advantage is that the rally is suitable for pro and amateur athletes, as during its stages there is a special course that contributes to the ranking. While for the rest of the course, the athletes can really enjoy the magnificent scenery. Before and after the race you can ride like you want, so you can really enjoy the landscape. If you want to stop, you stop. And then you have just uh, the race, uh, about 40 kilometers. So you, you have the race, and after and before the race, you ride to really your own uh, rhythm, and you can really enjoy uh, the landscape, and that's what I really like. I think it's for everyone, and certainly because you have not, uh, you, you have not a lot of place where you to push to, to, to uh, put the bike in your back. So you can do 90% of the trails you do on bike, and that is also important, I think, because mountain bikers come for biking and not for walking. So that concept is really good. The tracks, you can do 90% of the tracks, 95% of the tracks you can do it on bike. So I think it's really for everyone. Yeah. Let's go back to the action of the 7th International Mountain Bike Rally of Sardinia. A rather shy sun welcomes the first day of the competition. The athletes found themselves in Arzana, where at 9am the first of the three stages began. Stage 1 was 51.5 kilometers in length, of which 49.15 kilometers were the special stage and featured a total ascent of 1,670 meters. <laughs> With 
With a time of 2 hours, 24 minutes and 48 seconds, the Spaniard Ismael Ventura took home the special stage and stage one. Uh, today was the first day here in Sardinia. It was a day to look at uh, how is the trails and how are the stages here. Uh, it was pretty rocky. It was also super wet. It's not usual to be that wet here, unless that's what people tell me. <laughs> so today was for me it was a good day. It was I was riding at my own pace all the time, and there was some technical parts. Uh, at the end, it was a very demanding single track, and also in the middle of the stage. So I rode uh, careful there to try to avoid mechanical something like that. The second day of competition at the rally didn't start in the best of ways. Late the previous evening, the government weather alert pushed the organising committee to change the route, foregoing the 111 kilometre track. The new route was 40 kilometers with 1,750 meters of ascent and a special test of 20.9 kilometers, beginning by crossing the ruined abandoned village of Gaido Vegie before climbing up into the fog to the Astronomic Observatory. Come seconda tappa um un bel percorso, molto scorrevole, molto scorrevole, il tempo, il tempo anche ottimo perché via, per via della molta salita, molte, molto dislivello, siamo riusciti a rimanere, almeno sono riuscito a rimanere con una temperatura molto costante, non ho sofferto il freddo per, per nessun motivo, il percorso molto scorrevole, divertente e un'ottima tappa, sì. The third stage was the most demanding. Due to the rain, the athletes had to ride a wet course and cross under the cave of Nurage Sebisi, a neuragic complex dating back to the 18th to 10th centuries BC, before crossing the finish line at Barisado, completing the 102 kilometer course. Spanish champion Ismael Ventura won all three stages and was the winner of the 7th International Mountain Bike Rally of Sardinia. It was second place for Baduena Paulo and third place for the local Oras Davida. Yeah, for me it was uh, super good three days of racing. I feel good every day. Uh, I'm now in the off season more or less at this time of the year, but anyway I feel pretty good. Uh, I race at my own every every day and I enjoy the trails a lot. I was uh, in this last stage with the mud and the wet. Uh, I was trying to don't make any mistake for the mechanicals, don't have problems like a flat tire or something like this. And it works pretty well. After five years, the seventh international mountain bike rally of Sardinia finally concluded. And it has kick-started the interest in a new Zero edition, promising to revive competitive racing in the world of mountain biking.